Hello, Jamalov here and welcome to this very quick intermission to Skyrim Roleplay Series 2. Firstly, the most important thing, this is the video to ask Yulik questions. Ask me questions about the character, about the let's play. You can ask questions in any of the videos, but this is the best place to do it. I'll be answering the questions in the future, in character as I play, or when Yulik is traveling and nothing else is going on, or I might even do a separate answers video, we'll see. But in the questions, ask away. I have already talked about some things, it doesn't matter if you ask the same things, anything goes, just ask. Um, just know that I won't be answering many questions in the comments, but in the, in the upcoming videos. Um, secondly, something you might notice in the next part, uh, compared to the previous part, which was shot on purpose, by the way. Uh, it didn't make it didn't make sense to connect that to the next part. But anyway, something you might notice. I had to restart the game, and as a result, Yulik's skills are a bit different in game. As far as the story goes and the role playing goes, everything is the same, of course. This never happened. But uh, I had to restart, I backtracked the important things, Hersin's quest, uh, killing the bandits in pile cults. But uh, some things didn't happen, I haven't been attacked by the ducks, so they are coming back. So we'll just roleplay that the hunters are not giving up on Yulik and they are sending more, more, um, more ducks uh, after him. But uh, just to let you know, Yulik's skills will be a bit different. He's about the same level, and uh, I got important items back, uh, but I won't have the horse. I also weaved that into the story a bit, and uh, I don't have a have as many items as I did, and I don't have uh, more or less any gold. But uh, as the previous part already started that, uh, I, uh, I put that into the story as well. But that was really all I want to say. Ask Yulik questions, ask me questions about Yulik, and then uh, just a heads up about the uh, in-game changes. Uh, I will end this video with uh, only blooper I've had so far, and uh, it is related to certain pantless armor. And uh, with that, I thank you for watching, ask questions, and uh, I'll see you in the next part. Take care. Yes, I can feel its protective powers, and I can also feel the gentle breeze in my balls. But this armor doesn't have any pants. <laughs> <clears throat> Doesn't have any pants. And the open chest is something I'm not gonna. <laughs>